Hey guys, welcome to my channel and today we're going to talk about black salt, what it is, what it's used for, and how to make it. What is black salt? It's just regular table salt or sea salt or any kind of salt you can get your hands on where you put charcoal dust and ash inside of it or on top of it and you mix it. With the ash and the coal dust, uh, it covers up the, the salt and it makes it black. Now black salt is great for banishments, protection, boundaries or shields, circle castings uh, to actually put around the circle as to protect you from anything coming in and making a boundary. Uh, it is not meant for cleansings. Do not use it for cleansings because it's not meant for that. Regular white salt would be for that. And now this video that you're going to see is an old video of mine of how to make black salt. Hope you enjoy. This is what you will need generally for this to make some black salt, which is obviously salt that I just got from the kitchen. Nothing really special about it. Uh, mortal and pestle. You could use the ash from your ca uh, um, cauldron, which is mine. And you will, you know what this is. Basic, oh, actually, let me get my balmy. I don't need it. Okay, this is what you do. You burn incense of some sort. I don't know what you burn, but whatever it is, you burn something. Um, which is, that's why I have this here, which is the ash of my uh, cauldron is in there. You put a little bit of your ash. The reason that you put the ash is because you want the whatever is left of your of whatever it is that you burned because of course you're not going to burn something in a bad way you're going to burn it to to bring prosperity luck protection you know that's that's what you, we normally make incense for in a certain way um so that energy could still be in here or is still in here in the ash of whatever's left. So you take the ash, you put a little bit of salt in it, which I put a little too much, but that's okay. And then just to give it a little more black color, I like to take this, which no, this is not turn it, it does not, um, does not make the, make anything burn. You're not going to put this on fire. So you're not gonna have sparks coming up. There's no like fire hazard or anything like that. I've used um, coal, self-lighting coal to do this for many, 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 many years. Well, not many years, but long enough to know that it's perfectly fine. I'm not gonna, you know, burn down the house or anything. And I mean, you could just, you can just do this. And I don't really put a lot of pressure. It doesn't really need too much pressure and you get like this gray consistency. You can leave it in a gray consistency. But I like it very dark. So I normally take like half of one of these and just pour it in there. Because the ash is, you want the, the magical component of the ash, of what it used to be before you burned it. And then you want the blackness because it's protective. And you just stir it in there. You don't really have to like use the pestle too much. And just mix it up. Oh well. Now this is gonna take me a much longer time. I'm just showing you like the basics, but this is gonna take me a lot longer to make it black. Because I'll show you the difference. There's this one that's black and then there's this one that's gray. So, and if, this is something I like doing, but you shake it, you open it, and I don't know if you can see it, but there's smoke coming out of that. And I love it because it has this sort of uh, uh, look that if it's, that it's still alive, that, you know, it's almost like you can see the magic or the, the energy that's inside of it. And I love that. It's like a, it's, it's, it just gives it this, this sort of sense of, of power. But, uh, but yeah, that's how I make my black salt. I hope you guys like and I hope it was informative. If you have any questions or any advice on what I should do different, if anything, because that's how I was taught to do it, um, please let me know, you know? 
Um, sharing information is good. I want that. So, uh, yeah, that's all I've got. So I'll see you guys around. Love and respect each other. And many, many blessings.